Hey, what's up guys? Tony from WarcraftTV.com and uh, this video is something I thought you might find interesting. I'm doing a screen capture here. Uh, Twitch has bought Curse, Curse.com, uh, which is where we get our World of Warcraft add-ons. It's the most popular place. You can get it some other places, but it's the most popular place. And in the past, I had done a video about how to install add-ons from Curse, and I was going to update that, and I came across this. So you can see here on this web page, it says, Say hi to Curse, the newest member of the Twitch family. And you can read this quick little blog post on, on Twitch's website, just saying that they agreed to acquire the company. So now Twitch owns Curse. I don't know if that's good or bad, but definitely means some stuff's changing. So when you go over to Curse, this is the page you see. Curse is evolving, and you can select between the Twitch desktop app and then this other button, click mods and add-ons. So when you click that one, which is what we're concerned with, I mean, if you're a Twitch streamer, yeah, okay, you'll deal with that. But as far as installing add-ons, that's what this video is going to be about, installing add-ons in World of Warcraft. When you click that, go to mods and add-ons, you'll get this other page. And here, if you don't already have the client installed from Curse, you need to go up top into this menu bar and click Client. And now you'll see when you go there, it says download the Twitch desktop app anyway. Okay, so you're just going to go ahead and download it. Click Download, install it. You'll probably have to create a user ID just so that it can sync all your add-ons up to the cloud and such. Okay, um, so this is the Twitch desktop app and I actually have the old version it doesn't say twitch on it this is the curse one and it looks like yeah, it looks pretty similar looks like it's basically the same thing only with twitch branding on top of it so instead of curses branding it'll everything will have twitch branding uh, fine okay so when you download the add-on it'll be this only it'll be in twitch purple okay and it has this little home page where you can click some stuff. It's like a news. There's a chat thing. I'm only following one person. Uh, back over here at the bottom says World of Warcraft. Here's the add-ons that I'm currently using, which you can see some need to be updated. You click get more add-ons and you can get more add-ons. It's that simple. This is the only client that is available. And now that Twitch has bought Curse, that's something you're going to have to download. You, you have no choice. If you want to install add-ons in this way, you can still do it manually by just grabbing the add-on, downloading it, and throwing it into the folder on your computer. This is just way easier to do. So you just want to download this Twitch desktop app now. Like I said, set up your account, and then you're going to go back over to here. Where is it at? This one. Go to Mods. You can look on the website. We'll just choose World of Warcraft. And this is, their website is so old, they haven't updated it forever. Um, this is exactly how it's always looked, as far as I can remember. And, of course, the add-ons are different because people, you know, add them. So, download this add-on. Of course, now everything will say Twitch, so just ignore the red. It'll be purple now. And you're going to want to go to World of Warcraft. You want to get more add-ons. And then you can browse by all the categories. You can search for specific ones. If somebody told you, hey, go get this add-on, you can just type it in the search. And, uh, you know, like Deadly Boss Mods, DBM, okay, things like that. And it's really that simple. And then you just come, you open this up every once in a while, and you'll click Update, and it'll update the add-ons that you have. See, I'm updating them right now. You don't even have to think about it anymore. This is the easiest way to install add-ons in World of Warcraft at the moment, okay? And now that Twitch has bought Curse, I don't know, maybe things will get better. I don't know. I think they're okay now. But it does have this chat feature, which if there's a Twitch streamer, like me maybe, that you want to chat with, you can click this chat thing and uh, hop over there and chat with them and if that's what you want to do. Anyways, that's how you install World of Warcraft add-ons at this time using the Curse Now Twitch client. So again, you can still go to curse.com. It'll prompt you to download this Twitch app.
okay? So go ahead and download the Twitch desktop app, and you're good to go. That's it, guys. Make sure you subscribe. See you in the next one.